Hey, I'm Caleb from Caleb's Aviation. Welcome back to this surprise installment of Aviation News. This is all about the American Airlines new order. Let's get into it. The first item today, American has ordered the 737 MAX 10. This is probably the most shocking news we're going to cover today, and there are several reasons why. First off, for those who don't know, American currently flies a large fleet of 737s, having more than 360 units at the time of recording. However, all their 737 MAX units have been for the MAX 8, as the only 737 they currently fly is the predecessor to the MAX 8, the very popular 737-800. Far, they have ordered 85 MAX 10s in hoping to expand their fleet, converting some MAX 8 orders to the larger MAX 10. Also, I flew the MAX 8. Check out that video, by the way. They have also ordered more Airbus A321s. They currently fly 288 of the A321, between a few different variants. They fly 200 of the standard A321-200 variant, used for short to medium haul domestic routes. I also flew that A321, check out that video. They also fly 48 of the special A321T variant, used to fly transcontinental routes. These are different to their other A321s as they have fully flatbed seats for flags at first, which will be retired by the end of the year. They also fly the Airbus A321 Neo, with 70 Neos currently in the fleet, and 99 more on order, 50 of which are for the A321 XLR variant. These will be used for medium to long haul routes within the American Airlines network, even helping grow some short haul international flying. This latest order will add 85 A321 Neos to the order book, bringing it up to a total of 184 coming in soon. However, that's the shocking part about ordering the MAX 10. The 321 Neo, which they already fly, competes directly with the MAX 10, as does the A321 XLR. So maybe American is hoping to really expand international flying on longer to medium haul routes. That's all I can think of. Finally, the third aircraft to join the American Airlines fleet are more Embraer 175s. These aircraft will be destined for their American Eagle regional fleet. American and American Eagle will add 85 Embraer 175 aircraft to the fleet. This will help them grow to short to medium haul domestic regional routes. However, they didn't order the Embraer 175E2. Perhaps that would have been a better fit. Well. That's all I have for you in this quick installment of Aviation News. If you liked, make sure to subscribe, ring the notifications, leave me a comment, and also check out my Caleb's Aviation podcast. A new episode is up now. It's one you definitely won't want to miss. However, that's going to do it for me. You know the drill. As always, I'll be wishing you blue skies and tailwinds.